Hey guys, my name is Ruth and I am a part of the amazing Audacious North location. And today I have the privilege of sharing my salvation story with you, which is a pretty long one, but I'm going to try and keep it short. See, I was born into a really strict practicing Muslim family where from as soon as we were able to speak or walk, my dad would send us to Islamic school so that we could learn how to read the Quran and also learn the five pillars of Islam and how to practice them. And um, from the age of about six or seven, I was already praying five times a day. Uh, from about the age of eight or nine, I'd already started to uh, fast in the month of Ramadan. And when I was about 10 or 11, my dad had started allowing me to go away for weekends and school holidays to Islamic camps so that I could learn uh, the teachings of the Prophet. And uh, so growing up, I had massive issues with the Christian faith. See, I believed that Jesus was from God. I believed that he was a prophet of God, but I had massive issues with Christians proclaiming that Jesus was God or that he died on the cross or that he was the son of God. Uh, and so I thought, I thought that was the biggest blasphemy of all. So I took it upon myself uh, to start uh, reading and studying the translation of the Quran uh, from Arabic to English, just so that I could preach to people. So I became this Muslim missionary. I even went further and started to study the New Testament so that I could um, argue with the Christians and tell them that, you know, there were holes and different accounts of, of the Bible, that there were inconsistencies in different account, uh, accounts of the Bible. So I would go, you know, Matthew says this, but Mark says that, and John said this. So I, I literally thought that I knew it all. But when I was about 15, um, I had the strangest encounter. So I was, I was praying, um, and as I was about to put my head on the ground, I heard clearly John 14, 6, where Jesus said, I am the way, the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. See, this was not an audible voice. I'd never heard the voice of God before, but I knew that today, this time, I knew that this wasn't just me. This wasn't just things filtering through my thoughts. And I would subsequently have more of these encounters where I would be praying and different Bible verses um, would start speaking to me. Some about the love of God, so that, you know, about Jesus, you know, loving the world, um, uh, John 3.16, different Bible verses that I had prepared to, to argue with Christians about. Uh, this, this Bible verse started to invade my prayers um, and they weren't just ordinary ones, they were quite um they were quite meaningful ones so i i would cry myself to sleep at night and i started to pray please god if jesus is really and truly god if the god of the bible is god please would you just reveal yourself to me and with time god started to speak to my heart and um I started to go to sneak to church on Sundays, like Sunday mornings, I would sneak to church and tell my family that I was going for special prayers um, at the mosque. And uh, I remember the first time I went to church, I loved the worship and also the, the preach was almost like, it was almost like the, the, the pastor knew about me. Um, eventually when I went to university, I started to go to church freely. And um, I remember, um, my first Sunday in church um, and there was an altar call um, where, you know, they said, you know, if you want to be a Christian, uh, raise up your hand. And the, and the preacher said, actually, I think some someone here wants to, you know, boldly proclaim their faith. Um, if you're that person, come to the front. And I found myself walking to the, to the front. So, so I became a Christian. Um, I can't say that becoming a Christian, I can't say it has been easy because as Pastor So's message said, you know, we are not apathetic. We keep fighting. We fight temptation. We fight, we fight various things. But the difference is that, 
you know, we now have, you know, this father who also fights on our behalf, who gives us the, the strength to fight. We are able to put on the armor of God to protect us as we fight these battles. And, and this father that fights for us now happens to be the king of kings and the Lord of lords. See, my story is not, oh, Muslim girl becomes a Christian. My story is not at all about a religious conversion. My story is as cheesy as it may seem sound it was a love story because I can truly say Jesus pursued me himself and I can say love found me see I don't know where you're at uh, in your journey but I want you to know that you are a child of God and that was another thing that you know that Jesus started to show me he showed me my identity that I am not this slave girl that needs to stay on the outside toiling and looking in but that there is a place for me at the table see when Jesus died and he shed his blood on the cross of Calvary that blood that cannot be wiped off that blood that is like an indelible ink that blood was used to write my name and your name um, was used to write our names uh, on a placemat at the table of the king. So you're not this stranger, you know, wandering in and we're like, yeah, now, now that you're in, pull out a chair and sit down. No, you have a place at the table of the king. You have a table, you have a place at the table of your father who truly loves you. Because as I walk this journey, now I know that I don't have to fight for acceptance, that Christ just loves me. I am so convinced and so secure in this love that now I know that if I was the only person that needed saving, Christ will still have gone to the cross just for me. So um, I hope this has spoken to you. And I just pray that as you go about your day today, that, you know, God would speak to you. And I pray that if you need to yield to that voice, I am praying for the strength and the grace for you to, to listen and to yield to that voice um, of the, the father that is waiting for you with arms open wide. So, yeah, have an amazing day. God bless you. Bye bye.